Hey, you! Are you talking to me? Yeah, jerk! I saw you making eyes at my Eunice! Oh, lay off, Ernie. He's kind of cute. You think you can just waltz in here and make a play for another fella's girl? Give me a break. She's not... my era. Now you're gonna insult her? I oughta paste you one right on the- Let him go, Ernie. Jeez, you're a mean drunk. You're doing it again. You're trying to steal my girl, ain't you? Give me a break. She's not... my era. Now you're gonna insult her? I oughta paste you one right on the- Let him go, Ernie. Jeez, you're a mean drunk. You're doing it again. You're trying to steal my girl, ain't you? Maybe. What are you gonna do about it, chicken? That's it! You're toast! <clears throat> Looks like you need to cool off for a few. Sorry, lady. I didn't mean to get your boyfriend kicked out of the club. Oh, water under the bridge. You want to keep his seat warm? Uh, thanks anyway. El Kid. I still don't get it. It's like that El Cid place down in L.A., only it's El Kid. Ah, okay, I see. Hey. Back off, kid. I'm trying to entertain some people here. I know you, you're... Parker, Oscar Danny, Danny Parker, Hill Valley PD. Uh, have we met? Y you look my failure. Nah. Well, stranger, sit down and have a drink on me. I hear you've been having troubles. Troubles? Buddy, nobody knows the troubles I've seen. Want to talk about them? Do, do I? Do I? Yeah, I do. Listen, it all started when this... Car. Every morning, every evening, ain't we got fun? Not much money, oh, but honey, ain't we got fun? Whoopee! Yeah, dear. now about those we troubles. Oh, I don't want to wallow in misery. I came here to get happy. Hallelujah! In the winter, in the summer, don't we Shouldn't you be arresting Tannen? For Tons what? Well, for running a speakeasy, for one thing. Well, I like this speakeasy. So there. Besides, if I arrested him, I'd have to arrest you and me and everyone else in here. And that's just way too much work for one little cop like me. Should you be drinking so much on duty? Probably not, but this joint ain't open when I'm off duty. See you later, Danny. I'll be here. I'm supposed to get this guy to arrest Kid Tannen tonight? those troubles it all started on uh, uh, June 14th I was chasing down one of Tannen's boys when this uh, this car straight out of Buck Rogers popped up out of nowhere and ran my car off the road no then later I I lost track of a witness the poor schlub hasn't been heard from since 
That wasn't your fault. And then, to top it off, I somehow managed to lose custody of an 80-year-old arsonist. And then not one, but two of those godforsaken space cars showed up and whisked him away. That's unbelievable. That's what the chief said. Demoted me on the spot. My family sent me to a psych psychiatrist because they thought I was seeing things. And worst of all, my gal Betty left me because she thinks I'm a bad provider and a head case. <laughs> Betty? As in Jennifer's grandma Betty? <laughs> what? Listen, Danny, it's really important that you get back together with Betty. Oh, that ship sailed. What the heck with her? I got a little secret that'll set me up with women twice as classy as Betty will ever be. You've got a secret? What is it? I don't think I should tell you. When I'm sad like this, I don't think straight. But listen. Yes? I like you. You're my new best friend. See you later, Danny. I'll be here. that secret oh yeah my secret well you're my pal so I can tell you but don't let it get out I've been working for Tannen for over a month now what it's true all I gotta do is look the other way while evidence is getting destroyed or a truck full of gin is coming across the county line and Tannen makes sure an extra bunch of bills makes their way into my pay envelope Great deal, huh? No, not a great deal. What's the problem? People need to drink, right? As long as no one's getting hurt, why shouldn't Daniel J. Parker make a few bucks on the action? What about Artie McFly? Hasn't he been missing for two months? That's true, and all signs point to a tannin job. Oh, God. I've made a horrible mistake! I thought if I could get my hands on some money, that Betty'd take me back. But when she finds out what I've done, she'll never even talk to me again. <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> Come on, Danny, pull yourself together. It's not so bad. Not so bad? I'm a corrupt cop who's lost his only chance at true love. How's that not so bad? <laughs> Hang in there, Danny. Oh, God. She's no Pat Benatar, but not bad, not bad. I shouldn't bother her while she's singing. Danny, 
Woo! Trust me, things will get better. Just keep listening to the music. Why? None of the words help anymore. <laughs> I don't think there's anything in this speakeasy that can turn this guy around right now. Hang in there, Danny. Oh, God. Hey, what? Talk to you later. Hey, look, a paying customer. Hey, Artie. He's back. Grandpa Artie's pipe. You know, I could barely remember Grandpa from when I was a kid, but this smells like him. Heavy.